what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you guys a video all about my inspiration for my new living room and office space. So I wanted to talk to you guys kind of about how I got the vision for what I did and where I got all my stuff and all that kind of process. So stay tuned to this video if you want to see more and don't forget to like and subscribe. So first I want to give you guys some context and so I want to talk about how big of a deal for me it is to be able to actually decorate my apartment the way that I want to because at the age of 25 I have just now gotten to the point where I can afford to really decorate and buy furniture and all that kind of stuff. Um, before this point I always got hand-me-downs or went to like a church resale store and bought stuff and repainted it and you know made it new and so it was really exciting for me as a person to be able to say wow like I could actually afford to buy a new couch and a new desk and all that kind of furniture type of stuff. So it was super exciting for me to be able to decorate and all that kind of thing with this. At first I was a little overwhelmed. I was like looking at all of these like home decor inspo pages on Instagram and I was just like wow like these rooms look amazing and I can't decorate like that. But uh, so it was a little overwhelming but you know after a while I kind of just started picking out things that I liked. Um, it just was like, you know what, this will go good together, and this will go good together, and I'm still a work in progress. You'll see in this video, I'm still a work in progress, but I'm loving the stuff that I got so far. So I definitely wanted to tune you guys into this process of redoing my apartment. And so I will be doing a full apartment tour after I finish everything, but I definitely wanted to show you guys kind of like the what point we're at right now. So my bedroom is going to be the next project and so I will keep you guys involved with that and how I'm going to be looking for inspo and all that kind of stuff with my room. But yeah, definitely want to share with you guys kind of how I've redone my space. Now that we're going to be, you know, doing lipstick and curls full time, I'll be working from home full time. So I definitely want to make sure my space was very inviting and very kind of inspirational. And so that's a lot of the reason why you'll see that a lot of my uh, wall decor and just different things that I have set up are very inspirational, maybe inspirational words or whatever, so that that can always spike my creative senses or just make me feel inspired in some way when I might be not feeling that inspired some days or whatever. So yeah, a lot of it is contrasting. So I love playing with dualities as far as like soft and hard, light and dark. And so I loved kind of playing with those kind of ideas when I was creating my space. So definitely from my faux cow skin hide, whatever you want to call it, to my faux fur blanket on my couch and then the pinks and the dark colors and the lighter colors and the grays to kind of help transition from like that soft to hard kind of look and feel. So I played with all those different textures and all that kind of stuff, colors to really create a dynamic space. So now I'll go ahead and walk you guys through my space. So as you can see, my rug here that I talked about just a second ago. This rug is from Urban Outfitters. It was on sale for $150, I believe. And then my couch is from Ikea. It's the new couch they just released a few weeks ago. And obviously I will link all this stuff down below. Um, you can see my kitchen area back there is not super organized, but like I said, we're getting there y'all. Um, and then you can see my workspace down here. I'll go ahead and show you guys this area. And so basically I got a new desk this corner desk is also from ikea the be bold brave and brilliant text decor is also from urban outfitters as well as this paint splatter in the background is also from urban then all these little trinkets and stuff are from different places like home goods and nordstrom and target those are my favorite places to go for home decor and then here is my beauty shelf with all of my beauty products. I have a little bit of greenery and a Buddha head on top for some zen. And then as you can see, all of my products that I have and then all of my makeup stuff on top of this drawer that I also got from Ikea. So yeah, that's my space. And as you can see, I've got a little bit of organizing still to do, but I tried my best to kind of organize it as much as possible. It's gonna take me a while to figure out the best way to organize all of my stuff but yeah this is it for right now I've got a few more pieces to get um, but all in all this is my awesome space I'm so excited about it and let me know what you guys think until next time talk to you guys later bye